All right, so this is a much needed update on my 20 gallon, which I actually have found out it's a 25 gallon uh, salt water tank. It's been about uh, five months since I probably made an update, and there's been a lot of changes to start. I've added another 10 pounds of live rock, and uh, it totally changes the whole scape of the tank. I've uh, got a new fish. I've added a fire gobby. Um, I've added a few Mexican turbo snails. They're a great cleanup crew. I have a few brittle starfish, uh, feather dusters. Um, unfortunately, there's a few bristle worms. They're not they're not too bad. I actually find them a bit useful. I'm not worried about getting rid of them. Uh, I've added a pistol shrimp, probably with the loudest snap anyone's ever heard. Although he doesn't come out very often. Um, and of course, I've added a lot more corals. I have uh, some mushroom coral now, more polyps, I have uh, pulsing polyps, uh, I think I have some tricolor polyps, the hammer is grown, um, I have a lot of hermit crabs with uh, shells all over the bottom of the tank so I'm to switch into as they grow, and I've added an egg crate for a lid, and I've uh, got a T5 light now. The Coral Life one puts it a lot more power than the previous light I had. As that was almost a joke. Um, basically, everything's been going pretty well, and only real maintenance I have to do is wire change. I do about 10% wire change once a week, and I just top up the water daily. I feed the corals and the fish cyclopes and uh, flakes. And I'm hoping to get another addition to this tank. I had a lawnmower blenny, but unfortunately it died. And I also uh, bought a Royal Grama, which also died. I should have known better than to buy that fish. It was in a tank with uh, three other dead fish. And it died within the first two days. It was properly acclimated and everything. It's just, I guess it was a bad batch of fish. Um, I'll keep you guys updated on a more regular basis. For now, I just explore my tank. Mm -hmm.